Tonight at 6, big changes on the horizon for policing in a small Missouri town. First Lord Four told you the Franklin County Sheriff's Department is taking over and patrolling for the city of New Haven. Yeah, that's about 60 miles west of downtown St. Louis with a population of around 2,300 people. Russell Kinsell breaks down the new policing plan that's in the works there, Russell. So New Haven faced a difficult situation. They had less than half the necessary number of officers. A brand new chief suddenly resigned, raised concerns about the department's evidence lockup. So the Board of Aldermen decided to go in a new direction. They disbanded the police department and asked the Franklin County Sheriff's Office for help. Here we are. There's no police in New Haven. So it was very disheartening and very concerning. Amanda Regal worried about safety in New Haven. What's the reason they dissolved the police department and what else is going on over there? Lewis Klingert voicing the questions that many are asking after learning the town's police department has been disbanded. Reassurances coming from the Franklin County Sheriff's Office. A deputy will respond if residents call 911. Absolutely. Uh, matter of fact, all weekend somebody has been assigned to the city limits of New Haven. John Hulquist was sworn in as the new police chief on January 8th. After less than a month on the job, he suddenly resigned on January 31st. In his resignation letter, he said, because of what I now know, I have no further desire to be associated with the New Haven Police Department in any capacity. He raised concerns about the department's evidence locker. The evidence locker does bring some concerns. City Administrator Kathy Trentman said the Board of Aldermen held an emergency meeting and on February 2nd voted to disband the police department. Well, since we disband our department, we no longer can have officers here, so uh, unfortunately they have lost their jobs with the New Haven Police Department. The Franklin County Sheriff's Office had already been covering for the times New Haven didn't have an officer on duty. It will continue to provide police services for the next six months. The contract is for um, 16 hours a day, and so somebody will be assigned here then, and then uh, for the other remaining shifts, the zone car will be um, assigned to be a lot closer, so the response times will be at a minimum. The Sheriff's Office is now conducting an audit and inventory of the evidence locker and Major Wild says whatever they discover will determine what comes next. So the cost of the six month contract with Franklin County still being worked out. New Haven has until August to decide whether to start up a police department again or sign a new contract. Russell Kinsall, first alert for Russell. Thank you. Drone